So now let's work around with strokes inside of Toon Boom Harmony. So to work around with strokes, you can go over here onto the left side. There's this paint tool right here and here is strokes. So once you actually draw stroke, you can see that a message appears. If I were to press OK, it is invisible. So to actually see the stroke, you have to press the K key on your keyboard. So let me just delete this stroke right over here. Once I go into the strokes, I can work around with different options of stroke. These four as are what we're going to focus on. The first one is the straight line. The other one right here is the free form right over there. The other one over here is the closed gap. So if I were to use this, you can see that the gaps are closed and colors are filled over here. But if I were to turn this on, then the edges are deleted off. So these are the options provided in the stroke. So let me use this and add in some details to our drawings. So I'm going to select all of this and delete it right now. And let's see how to utilize the stroke. So to utilize the stroke, I have to remember that they are invisible lines itself. So I'm going to go over here onto, uh, onto my shape. So I'm going to go over here onto my shape and then bring out something like an ellipse. So let me just uh, drag out the ellipse right over here. So as I drag out the ellipse, uh, I'm going to add and fill it in with a color. For that, I'm going to take a paint bucket tool. Don't worry about the details right now. I'm going to choose a color for this. So let me add in a new color. Double click here, choose the color. We're going to learn more about this in the further lessons. So I'm going to choose a color just like this, and I'm going to fill this in with a color, as you can see right here. Let me choose a darker color right here, just like this. And as I change, you can see that it changes the color over here. So I'm going to add something like a light source. So let's say the light source is here and it is reflecting onto the light and this is where it is shadowy. So what I can do is I can use the stroke tool now. I'm on the same layer as the spear as you can see. So if I were to draw in something like a spear, like a stroke, you can see that an uh, additional layer and additional space where I can add in fill has been added. Let's also add in a stroke right over here onto the top just like this just like this over here. And that's how the stroke is added. Let me just press Ctrl Z. I want it to actually close out just like this. So that's where the shine is actually happening. Let's say for example, and there's a bit of stroke on over here on the front and there you go. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add in some shades over here. So I'm going to add in new color and I'm going to add in a bit of a darker tone of the color for this one. So let me just go over here and choose a darker tone. So let me just go for a darker tone and I'm going to take my... So now uh, what we're going to do is we're going to add in uh, details right here. So I'm going to go for paint and add in the shade just like this. So over here, this is the sign and you can see that how easily you can add in colors. So you can actually go over here and then add in the shine right over there and one over here as well. Let me use a white color for this one. And you can easily see how we can add in details just like this. So you can still see that the, the, uh, that the uh, lines are actually hanging out. It's usually not a good idea to leave out hanging lines like this. So usually it's just a good, good idea to select it and delete it. And as you add in colors, they will just stay there. So if I were to press K again, you can see that the detail is gone there. And now you can see how uh, dynamic this actually looks. So you have your spear over here. You have something like a sign and details over here, and that is what the stroke can be used for. So you can actually add in some details, add in some shades, just like this. So uh, that is how you can utilize stroke inside of Toon Boom Harmony. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.